Good morning, everyone. It's Pastor Tim Hammy. How are you doing this wonderful morning? I hope you're doing well. I hope everything's going great. I hope you had a great Monday. I'm going to invite some people in here and we'll get started. And uh, man, what a great Monday. And uh, we will get started. So, you know, when you think about all that you do on Mondays and you get your weeks started and and then you hang out and you get your week going, you know. So, I love spending these mornings with you guys. So, Proverbs 18.10 is the verse this morning. I want you to think about this. Just listen to it. It's actually a worship song, old worship song. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run into it and are in, are safe. The name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run to it and are safe. Think about that. So, the 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 Bible. Um, actually references this idea, this, this statement, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. It almost references, well, it's not almost, describes a refuge. Uh, the name of the Lord is a strong tower, right? A place of hiding, a place of safety, which then references the idea of a refuge and a protection. So when you begin to think about that, you begin to think of a place of safety, a home, a, a area of protection. Well, then you go back and you look at the cities of refuge found in the Bible where it was a place of protection. Well, the Bible also describes that the Lord is our protector. So I don't know about you, that really makes me excited because there are times when you never know. You just uh, know that you just need the moment of, of your fear, your anxiety. You just need that you're fearful, you're dire straits. You just need the feeling of being protected. And this verse here this morning says, the Lord is a strong type tower. The righteous run to it and are safe. Well, you got to know where you're going and how to get there. And if you're just kind of like, I don't know how to get there. Well, get in the word, get in the Bible, get know where you're going. If you're just kind of like, I just don't know how to get there. Pray about it. God will direct you. Um, the Lord of the, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. Call on his name. His name is Jesus. And uh, he'll show you the way. And uh, it's, there are moments in life where you just kind of go, well, I think I can do this on my own. I'm, I'm good. Well, I know that sometimes people are not good. We make that statement as a passe statement in, in life. I'm good, you know. Or when you, someone, you greet somebody and you say, how you doing? And then we're so quick with that question and we don't really care about that, that person to know how they're doing, to stop and say, how are you really doing? And look in their face to know how they're really doing, right? And, uh, and really care of that much to really... Say, you know, how are you really doing? And really understand that question. How are you really doing? And care enough to stop and listen to see how they're doing and pray for them. See, Jesus is the strong tower that we run to and, and, and that's our city of refuge and our protector. And that's key. He, he'll get us through each day as as we press in, as we get through each day. And uh, good morning, Larry. And that is so key for each day. It's how I get through each day. And I hope you take that challenge as well. So today's verse is Proverbs 18.10.
And it says this, it says the Lord, the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run to it and are safe. So write that verse out, put an O, observe it, A, apply it to your life, P, pray. So we're going to pray. So if you have any prayer requests, go ahead and put that in the comment area. We'll, we'll pray over that and we'll just uh, pray. So let's pray. Lord, thanks. Thanks for today. Thanks for those who are watching now and those who watch later. Encourage their heart today. And Lord, we just thank you. Lord, I pray for those that are sick today. I pray that you heal their bodies. And Lord, I thank you for that. I pray for those that are well, that you protect them from being sick. I pray for our government that you help them make good decisions. I pray for those that are in need that you provide for them. I pray for our economy that you turn it around. I pray that you help it. Help us to be a blessing to those that we come in contact with. And Lord, I do pray that you help us to be a blessing to those that uh, we come in contact with. And I pray that you help us to um, share the gospel with somebody today. And again, I do pray that you help us to be a, uh, share the gospel with somebody today. Lord, bless those who are watching now and those who watch later. Encourage this day, Lord, in your name. Amen. Hey, love you guys. Have a great Tuesday. And we'll see you tomorrow morning. Have a great day. Love you guys.